All right, good afternoon. It's your Pratt Pack. We're in the home office, and here are your headlines for this Thursday, August 30th, 2018. Weighing in on President Donald Trump's warning that there will be violence by his opponents if Democrats win control of Congress this fall, Vice President Mike Pence said he took the president to mean that the Democrats want to undo everything the president has done. John McCain's 106-year-old mother, Roberta McCain, plans to attend his memorial service in Washington Saturday and his burial at the U.S. Naval Academy in Maryland on Sunday. According to the Associated Press, Roberta McCain, who always called her son Johnny, lives in the nation's capital. A residential fire in Chicago left no survivors and killed 10 children who were attending a slumber party at the time of the fire. No adults were at the home and the apartment had no working smoke detectors. An Uber driver in Florida shot and killed a man who chased him and threatened him with a pistol in what authorities are calling a classic stand-your-ground case. Members of Congress have continued to strongly advise in public and privately this week that President Donald Trump should not fire Attorney General Jeff Sessions, especially ahead of the midterm elections, because of the political fallout the party could face. And former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin is not invited to any of the memorial services for her former running mate, Arizona Senator John McCain. This according to CNN. Palin became a part of the national stage in the summer of 2008 after McCain picked her to be his running mate in the presidential race. Sports, Trevor Williams pitched six innings of shutout ball, Bucks over St. Louis, 2-0 last night. They're at Bush Stadium again tonight to face St. Louis, airtime 7-15. Joe Musgrove gets the start, you can hear it at 93-7 the fan. And the Steelers kick off their final preseason game at Heinz Field at 7.30 tonight against Carolina. And the Dell Technology Championship, TPC Boston, is underway. It's the second event of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Have a great day and good afternoon from your Pratt Pack.